I'm Dylan. I am a fourth year here at UCSB, and I'm a double major in communications and psychological collaboration. A day in the life at UCSB, it is the first day of winter quarter. It was like a 25 minute walk, but I wanted to take my sister and my roommate to the perfect sunrise spot. We left the house around 6.30 because the sun was gonna rise at like seven. Keep in mind, I had five hours of class today, so I was gonna be on campus like all day, but watching the sunrise was 1000% worth it. I had like an hour to kill before my first class of the day, which was at 9 a.m., so I decided to pop into the library. I just answered some emails and was reading through the syllabus for some of the classes. For me personally, I always love to use Notion. First class of the day was Psych 113 Lab, which is complex systems with Mathematica. I ended up finishing the homework for the week during class. I have to say my favorite thing about the Psych major is the flexibility that it offers you. For example, like if you wanted to dive more deep into understanding neuroscience, there's so many classes you can take for that. But if you wanted to learn more about the social aspect of psychology, you're able to specifically choose those classes. So I really like the flexibility that it offers. From all the psych classes that I've taken in my past four years here at UCSB, here are the top four ones that I really enjoy. Number one is Psych 102, which is Intro to Social Psychology. Number two is Psych 120, which is Consciousness and Cognition. Number three is Psych 121, which is Mindfulness. And number four is Psych 124, which is Education Psychology. I had another hour to kill before my next class, so I decided to pop into the USAN. Second class of the day was Psych 153, which is Social Neuroscience. And my third class of the day was right after that, which was Psych 152, Social Cognition. I specifically chose to major in Psychological and Brain Sciences because I do want to enter the business and marketing world and I thought it'd be really interesting to understand human behavior. So I walked home as soon as I could and literally took a nap, passed out for an hour, then made sure to wake up to go on the daily sunset walk. If you're here and you're ever bored, I promise you go on this walk and you're guaranteed gonna run into someone that you know for sure.